Hello everybody, <laughs> welcome or welcome back, it's your girl Eve, thank you so much for tuning in, in case this is your first time here, kindly consider subscribing for my returning uh, subscribers, thank you so much for my premier gang, you are the best. So guys, today I'm in my kitchen, yes, and I want us to prepare supper with you. Uh, with me here, this is the main ingredient. These are gizzards, okay, chicken gizzards, okay, and this is what I want to prepare for supper with uh, greens here. It is right from the freezer, that way, yeah. So uh, for this marination, I used a uh, soy sauce, okay, I used ginger, a garlic paprika and black pepper to come up with the solution that i used to marinate uh, these gizzard actually i marinated them and they stayed overnight here yeah, and this will be so so tasty because uh, the marination is you know has gotten well into the gizzards i did the massaging so well okay so that is a long time so it will uh taste so 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 well so all i need is just uh, the cooking oil uh i've got a uh, red onions and salt i'll be adding just a pinch of salt since the spices are already salt so guys uh without wasting uh, much of our time let uh prepare this i forgot to mention that i'll be taking this with our kenyan fufu that is ugadi so i'll uh, be having gizzards creams and ugali and we will prepare everything together so let's get into the video so guys let's do this so i start just by you know eating my pot okay add little well i don't like you seeing much well so i'll just add little yeah this is enough yeah then i'll come in with my onions okay Adding your onions until they get uh, ready, try to roll them brown color. Okay, So guys, imagine I had to go fast and uh, take my son to sleep because tomorrow is school and a boy doesn't want to sleep. Anyway, we are back and as you can see, our onion is ready. Okay, our onion is ready. Okay, so just a few seconds and... Uh, See guys the gizzards oh it's even uh, it's been there for since hey it's been there for overnight so the marination has gotten well in there the juice so i don't need the tomatoes because everything else is here so guys i'll go in with my gizzards oh my goodness Okay. 
Happy aroma. Oh, wow. <laughs> so I just add a pinch of salt because, as I told you, you know, these spices are so salty. So I don't want to mess with my guitar. So I just add. So I will lower the heat. Okay. To medium high and cover our gizzards to cook. I'll cover it. Okay. For some minutes. So guys, tell me, have you tried gizzards uh, yet? How is the feeling? Like, how are they? If you've not... <laughs> You need to try this because it's so yummy. <laughs> yeah, it's so yummy and like I love kids that so much. So try it for your family, maybe for lunch, for dinner, and this will be amazing. So I'll leave it to cook as I do something else. <laughs> yeah. So guys, this is a minute. Huh? And yo, look at this. Yo. Look at how this does. Just add little water. And cover it to cook for some more minutes. Okay, meanwhile guys, let us be preparing our greens. So guys, in here, we'll be preparing our greens. So I'll start by eating the pot, then add some oil, 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 okay. Yeah. And then, I'll come in with my onions, onion, yes. Yeah, and guys, for my greens, I do not use onions. Yeah, I mean, sorry, tomatoes. I do not use tomatoes. I just use onions. And I'm done. Okay, and for my onions, I actually don't cook them for so long, okay? I actually do steam them, like steaming, because I don't wait for them to turn golden, that uh, brown. I just steam them. Yeah, I love steaming them on my grits, okay? So in here, I'll just add a pinch of salt. Yeah. Yeah. 
So I love Mudstar skin. Okay, I could even be prepared in my Ugani here, only that I'm shooting and it will be <laughs> add. But when I'm cooking, I usually put my Ugani here, the greens and the other, either beef or something. I just love Mudstar skin. But for now, for the clear view, I have to do one thing at a time. So after this, we'll be preparing our fufu. <laughs> yes, our ugali. That is our Kenyan fufu. At this particular point, I'll come with my greens. Yeah, I'll add in my greens. Okay. Then I lower my heat. and cover it to cook here as we prepare ugali so let's get to the ugali ugali so guys for our ugali or rather our kenyan fufu well uh, boil water okay let's leave it to boil and then i'll come in with the maize flour and make a fufu so i've got my it's that here, my guy here, and my greens here. Yeah, and it'll be done in a few. For so my ugali, I usually go in with, you know, a little butter, just a little. Okay. Yeah. Bit by bit until you know, then I use the mico to make the ugali until I get the consistency that I need for my ugali. Uh, this is one of my favorite. A meal that is bugagi, especially with the creams. I love it now. This is in as a Kenyaji. Okay. So, now is bay. Just keep on doing this until you come to the right. So 
guys, I have to switch the, no? Because this one gives me more heat as compared to that one. And that is because my pizzas were already, you know, done and cooked. Let me tell you, I don't uh, prepare my fufu for long, okay? I actually see people preparing it for even hours, mm -hmm. but for me, I just prepare it for a few minutes, and I'm done here. Okay, my pizza's okay, my dinner is okay, so I'm ready to serve this. And yo, look guys, serve well hot. That is ugali, greens, and my gizzards. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. This is so yummy, guys. This is so yummy. So you are all welcome. Let's enjoy this meal. Oh my goodness. Look at this. <laughs> I can't wait to stop, you know, doing this and smash this food. <laughs> okay mm -hmm. so guys thank you so much for watching if you are with me until this point it means you are a genuine supporter thank you so much for your time so until next time it's a bye bye <laughs> let me enjoy the supper bye